Yo, it's Trent. Hope everyone's having a good day, good week, Thursday. One more day. Um, So this is slap boxing in school, right? And I was watching the Power Slap last night, posted three of those knockout videos. That's why I'm talking about the slapping today, right? So this was back in high school, a uh, little bit before I uh, went to Haber. Maybe, I think it was junior year actually it, it was either sophomore year or junior year that's all that matters but it was before I went to um the alternative school right so getting in trouble taking drugs but not kicked out to the point of getting kicked out yet right so I remember this all started in first of all it started in gym class right um because I had gym first hour this year whatever year it was but I had gym first hour and then I had, like, two classes and then lunch. Like, I had lunch the earliest I could have it, right? And in my gym, I had this kid that was on the football team. We were friends, so I'd hang out with him, right? And then we'd go to the next class together. Then the class after that, we'd take a break, but we'd meet back up at lunch. So it's like I saw this dude for the first half of my day uh, for, like, the entire time you have the schedule, you know? So half a year or a year or whatever. I don't know what it goes by semester, whatever it was. Um, I saw this kid a lot, right? And we were always joking about how like people could set up fights in the bathroom if they really wanted and people always messing around. Well, one day we we're like, you know what? What if there were like slap boxing fights, you know? And um, but we didn't start it or anything because there's already kids doing it. But we were kind of like, we should have our own little thing. We should we should have a little slap boxing tournament or something, right? And this kid was on the football team, and he's like, that's not a bad idea. And he's like, I would slap box this kid as we're at lunch. He's talking about the kid that's, like, two, three seats down. The kid's like, hey, I'll, I'll do a slap boxing round, you know? And we're like, okay, what what do we do? You know, he's like, let's just go to the bathroom, and then we'll just, we'll just slap each other until one of us quits, you know? Like, no punches, no elbows or anything, no wrestling, just trying to slap each other and block it, you know? So it started off with this kid that was, um... I don't know. I don't want to say slow or anything. He just mentally wasn't all there, right? Versus a kid that very strong in football. It's a little uneven, right? And the kid that played football didn't want to go too hard, but they just went softly, you know, and it was fine. And I had seen a couple other uh, slap fights and stuff like that in school, but it was just kids I didn't know in the bathroom, right? So I couldn't get involved or talk about it, right? Then one day, right, maybe two, three days later after this little event in the bathroom happens, I'm hanging out in study hall and that kid comes in, the one that I see in the beginning of the day, usually I wouldn't see him towards the end, but it was like one of the last periods I'm in study hall and he comes in and he was, I think I was in the library or something. He had to come there for something, right? So I see him and I'm like, yo, we should do a, a slap fight, right? But I didn't want to fight him because he, he would have beat me. He was bigger than me. So I was like, we should, we should set one up. I'd do one with somebody. And we're looking around the library, like, who would be down, you know? And we see this kid, a uh, year younger than me, but I'm, I'm like, 5'9", five, 5'10", five, right? 5'10", is, mm, but 5'9", for sure. This kid is over 6'1", six foot, six foot maybe 6'2". He wasn't giant. He wasn't, like, 6'4", or anything like that. But he was, he was tall. He was, like, 6'1", six, 6'2", six, right? Especially tall for me. So... I was like, do you want a slap box? You know, because he's a year younger than me. So I felt like I, you know, had a little advantage, but he's tall as fuck. So like if he does get me, you know, and he's got the reach. But I, I was confident. So I was like, hey, you want a slap box? You know, and we were friends. So it wasn't anything bad. You know, we were like, yeah, let's do it. We'll go till someone quits. Right. And I wasn't I did not think I'd get angry at all. Right. I was like, I've been slapped before by girls, guys, whoever. Right. Like, I'll be fine. And I was thinking, like, I'm not going to hurt him, obviously. Like, we're just going to mess around. So we started, right? We started squared off in the bathroom. The way the bathroom set up, right? Let me show you. So you walk in the door. Here's the door, right? Let's say you walk in. There's a little like blocker so you can't see anything. So you take two steps around it and then it's sink, sink, three urinals and then the two like toilets or whatever, right? But there's like, it's almost like a hallway, like where you come out of the stalls, you know? And then till the wall, there's like maybe the length of this door, the, the car, you know, like, side to side and then you could walk along the wall until the door you know what I mean or wash your hands go to the urinal like there was space there right so that's where we set up on either side of the bathroom and we go up and we start and I got a I got a little right hand immediately and he like he like pushed my left hand away but he didn't hit me right and I kind of went for a uh 
I quickly figured out, let me just try to duck, you know, because he's tall and it's hard to slap like underneath. So I just was trying to keep my head down and kind of throw above like that. And we're going, 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 and we got close together, right? So we're kind of bunched up and we kind of got into a little wrestling thing. You know, I pushed him back. He was holding on to me. We little slaps, right? All of a sudden, I go for a big slap, right? I try to like nail him. I go like this and he goes to block it. He goes like this. He puts up his knee. He puts up his hands too but he, when he did that like instinctively his knee went up hit me right in the nuts like right in the nuts square and i oh i thought i was gonna throw up i took a breath i was pissed right and he was like i'm sorry i'm sorry and i kind of just pushed him back and gave him the look like come on let's keep going you know but i wasn't like that pissed but it hurt you know so that kind of turned it on for me i was like okay like let, let's go now i'll slap you you know, without feeling bad. So he walked up and I didn't even hesitate. I just, it was the best slap I've thrown in my life, to be honest. I haven't thrown a lot of slaps since then. And maybe two or three. But, dude, I, it was like, it was like when you do arm, so, eh, arm circles, you know, like something like that. Like I came all the way over the top and just like went on a downward angle and just went right across his face like that, right? Left a huge print. It was so, it was super loud and there was like, four or five people watching the bathroom and everybody you know people go oh and like stuff like that but they all went oh. they were like damn like people gasped and i was like damn like it, it it stung my hand it was so hard and i looked and he had the red print on his face i was like god damn and he's like i'm good i'm good and i was like damn dude i was i did not expect to win that and he's like he's like my bad for kneeing you in the nuts but holy shit that felt like a punch and we were laughing or whatever and i won that one right but this one time, right? This one time I'm messing around and I'm watching my friend, the football player kid, do it against this other kid who he was going to win again, but it was still worth watching, right? And he was doing body shots at the slaps, right? And this kid, this other kid he was going against was not good. And um, yeah, they, it, it, it was pretty boring. But then I thought it would be funny, right? I'm like, I'm going to fuck with my friend and just start slapping him too. So it's a two on one. I was like, let me help this kid. That's not very good. Right. And he was kind of scared too, but I get it. You don't want to get hit. So we're messing around and I sneak up on my friend. I start hitting him, dude. He spun, eh, he spun with a 360, a 360 in the back of his hand. He backhanded me in the side of the face, dude. It hurt so bad. And I was, that's when I was like, okay, I'm done. I'm not doing this shit anymore. Cause like, if someone hits me hard enough, I'm just going to be knocked out. I'm not going to do well, you know, it's going to be fucked up. But damn, another funny thing is one time the computer guy walked in on us and it's the same guy that one time I was going to pee on a Friday, right? And I, I say on a Friday, I feel like it's important because if it was a Monday, I feel like things would have gone the other way. But it's a Friday, right? I was hitting my nicotine. I dropped it right in front of the computer dude who fixes the computers. Didn't say a thing. I picked it up, put it in my pocket, made eye contact. He didn't say a thing. What a guy. What a guy. Because he could have gotten me in trouble, you know, but he didn't. All right, so anyways, that guy one time walked in on these two kids slap boxing when we were watching him. That was funny. He was like, what's going on here? And he's like, this this is not okay. That's what he kept saying. He's like, this is not, this is not all right. This is not okay. So that was funny. But yeah, that's the fucking slap boxing things. I, I nailed the kid and I got nailed. And oh, my friend, this wasn't like a fight or anything, but I let my friend slap me on the back once, dude. And then I asked him if there was like a bad mark. He's like, no, no, no. And it was one of those slaps where it looks like the hands lifting off of your body, like the imprint, you know? I was like, that's fucking bad. <laughs> but what are you gonna do? All right. Hope everyone has a good day. I'll have a good story tomorrow for Friday, of course. Maybe some gaming videos. And um, I'm getting a puppy soon. So I'll have videos of that, of course. And peace out.